Governor Samuel Otom of Benue State has reiterated the need for ranching in the state. The governor stated this while visiting a female victim who recently lost her left hand to suspected headsman attack while in her farm. He says there is a need to separate genuine pastoralists from criminal headsmen. He also added that ranching will solve the problem of attacks on innocent residents in the state and urged the federal government to do all it can to curb the influx of foreigners who migrate into the country with their cattle to cause mayhem. I think this is an isolated case. And um, the security men are trailing uh, these herdsmen who are responsible. Uh, relatively, we can say that Benue State is peaceful, considering what we went through in 2018. Um, and that is why we must enforce the law on ranching in Benue State. Because these are white people. And the only way we can separate the good ones from the bad ones is when we have stock of all herdsmen in Benway State in their various ranches. If what you're seeing here, this attack on this innocent woman, was done in a ranch, the security men can close on, on such uh, owners of that ranch. But now, you can't find these people. They have gone, maybe they are from Niger. And I want to advise the federal government uh, to close border on also herdsmen who are foreigners. It is wrong to allow herdsmen from Mali, from Niger, from Chad to take over Nigeria. Meanwhile, the Benue state government says the Miete Allah Kautal Hori on Saturday apologized to the state governor Samuel Otom over the attacks and killings of the people in the state by herdsmen. Giving the apology on behalf of the association at a peace meeting held in Makodi, Benue state capital, the group's national secretary, Saleh Al Hassan, reportedly expressed regrets over the killings. He was said to have pledged to ensure peaceful coexistence between farmers and herdsmen in the state. According to a statement issued at the end of the meeting by the chief press secretary to the governor, Teva Akase, the peace move was initiated by the chairman of EPIS, Alan Onyema. Al Hassan gave the assurance that members of the group would embrace the peace initiatives put forward before, the before them by the governor.